Hello, welcome back to Tarot Time with Andy. Thank you for being here. This is my vibrational reading. Please do your own research for entertainment purposes and allegedly. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and thank you for the super thanks. Today I want to do one on Putin, and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to do one on Catherine Zeta-Jones and Michael Douglas. They are split. They have been living separately. So first let's get on Putin. Is he still alive? People are wondering if he's still alive. He hasn't been seen in, a, in a, an entire year, you guys. Some are saying that he's not here and they're just uh, flashing uh, lookalikes. So I'm using my pendulum here. Is Putin still alive? This here position, the way it's going now, is yes. That is no. Okay, so you can see the difference. Okay, side to side like a no head nod and a yes head nod. That is how it works. So got to have the yes for pointing me. And then when it goes sideways this way, that's maybe. Uh, this way is uh, rephrase. So that's what this whole thing says right there. You can see my little disc that I got from Sister Nobody, one of my loyal viewers. So here we go. Let's ask, is Putin still alive? Is Putin still on the earth plane? Is Putin still on the earth plane? Is Putin still on the earth plane? I'm going to put my feet down. Let's see. Ah, maybe I'll stand up. Here we go. Got to ground myself. Is Putin still on the earth plane? Is Putin still on the earth plane? Is Putin still on the earth plane? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Okay, they're saying then he will go out with a bang. He will go out with a bang as in a shotgun uh, or like Hitler. That he will not allow himself to be captivated or captured, excuse me, not captivated, captured. <laughs> he is not captivating. Here we go. A little, little slip of the tongue there. Here we go. So will he allow himself to be captured? Will Putin allow himself to be captured? No, he will not. That is a definite no. Will he take himself out? Will he take himself out? Oh, yes, he will. Yep, okay, will he use cyanide? Will he use cyanide like Hitler? Will he use cyanide? No. Will he use a hand weapon? Hand weapon? Yes. Okay, so that's what I get. Here we go. Let's throw some cards now and get that. I got my grounding feet down on the ground. Okay, Putin, Putin. So it's him, it's him. He's just going to wait it out till. It's a total loss for him. And, uh, yeah. So, I've always figured he would. You know, um, if, if his illness didn't take him out, then he would take himself out. There's no way he's going to allow it. It's loss of control. He's got that. He's a dictator. He's got very dictator energy. Very antisocial energy. Uh, you know, they're not going to bend for anyone. He will not bend. So, of course he's not going to bend. He will figure it's the most logical way to go out. Um, you know, he has antisocial personality disorder. So those types don't do it with tears and emotions. It just feels to them uh, the most strategic, best way to go out. Uh, kind of like the way Hitler did it. You know, you just wait till sirens are blaring and everyone's near and okay, now is the time. So let's get the energy. Putin, 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 Putin. Okay, subconsciously, yeah, everything's coming to a, to an end here. Everything's falling apart. It's the night. It's the night of wands in reverse. When he cannot change anything, and he cannot create change and move anywhere, and he's stuck and he's trapped, and he cannot change locations because knight of wands is all about growth enterprise it's very much the player energy he's the hero energy he thinks he's the hero when he thinks he's failed at getting what he wants and he can't change residences he cannot be a risk take take uh, be a risk taker and travel to a different location because the knight of wands travels and loves travel so he's he's been traveling he's been going from place to place to place to stay uh, in hiding, but when things are falling apart, which is the position I got it in, this is when he's more than likely do. He's going to be a rebellious energy. Uh, he's going to do something in a very, very big way because Knight of Wands does things in a very big way. They're very uncommitted, upright in reverse, completely uncommitted. 
wands tend to be uncommitted. They're very ego driven. So his ego is going to go on fire. His ego is going to feel realize, okay, I lost the battle. I've lost. Everything's falling apart. I don't want to deal with it. My ego cannot handle it. When their ego can't handle it, they're going to find a way to solve it. He's going to find a way to solve it indefinitely. So yeah, when everything falls apart, I think that's when he's going to do it. And it's going to be when he cannot change locations. Uh, changing locations has been his, his strategy as mostly that's what they do with these people. So yeah, his devil energy here. He is the devil uh, position here. Uh, there is no negotiating with him. Uh, upright, you can negotiate. You can come to ter terms. You can avoid extremes. He's going to do something very extreme. There is no negotiating with the dictator. He's in control. Temperance in reverse is very much devil energy. When things get completely out of control, he will manipulate his final end because he won't be able to move and travel and go anywhere. Challenging position. Is it going to actually work? Will he actually succeed at it? Uh, this is his promise that he's made to himself. It's fulfilling a promise. I will not be taken. I will not allow it. I have a plan intact. He has a plan. He will utilize it. Feelings in a situation. Focal point. Focal point. He will take himself out. He will give up the fight. He will mentally give it up. End of the road. It's come to the end of the road. The wheels are falling off. It is a crash and burn, so I'm going to crash and burn. He's going to give up the mental fight and the struggles and the challenge. The challenge is up. I lost. So it's when he loses the fight and he's mentally giving up and he knows he can't move anywhere and he knows that there is no go negotiating with the devil, with him, uh, and you don't do deals with him, he's got this plan in action. So this is his plan and this is exactly what he's going to do, just like what I read. <clears throat> so yeah, not surprised. Let's get this. So, yeah, he will. Definitely. Hands down. Hands down. How will it go for him? How will it go? Past position doesn't serve is a conscience. He's not going to be bothered by previous actions, thoughts, words, what he's done. His conscience doesn't bother him then. It's probably not going to bother him in the future. Not having a conscience just doesn't bother him. He will not weep and cry over himself or what he's about to do. There is no communication. He will not worry over communication. He's not going to cry and weep. He's not going to worry about a doomed mindset. He's not going to obsess over past words and actions. This is his healing way. It's embedded in his subconscious to take himself out because <clears throat> he has no conscience. He will go home. This is home. Also the home card, celebration of life. Then everyone will celebrate his life. A big party and celebrate his life. Yep, because he's an ego-bound guy. So, yes, they're going to celebrate him. Hidden, because he's going to take himself out. He, the painful ending is here. When he cannot go anymore, he's going to feel defeated, and he's going to accept it, and he's going to take himself out. Backstab himself. And he basically does have women in his life, and he's going to make sure that they do have some care. They're going to have to take care of themselves at this point. He doesn't have empathy for, you know, the women, the women that has his children. Uh, his feelings, his thoughts will be on them, that he's leaving them with the children. Uh, he's always planned it. They've been forewarned. They're aware that at some point in time, uh, he will not be seen. They will not see him. So basically, they're going to have to stand on their own. Uh, the Empress in reverse will have to uh, self-care. And um, they'll think, wow, that was kind of unkind. They won't have quite the abundance, but he'll probably make sure that they have some kind of care of some sort. Uh, he will, they will not, um, they'll be blocked. They will be blocked also because this is a blocked position. They're going to say no. They don't want him to do it, but he will do it. They're saying, no, please don't do it. Then we have here, they will be independent. They will be independent. These women will have to go into self-care, but they will live in a very comfortable, safe environment. And they will try, try to come to the terms okay. Uh, he made the most sound judgment for himself. There's been some investments made for them. And they will be comfortable and have an attachment to um, their home. Wherever they're at, they're going to have a nice, strong attachment with strong finances. No worries. Total independence without him. And they will be alone with self-care of themselves. 
the hopes and fears is it'll be to the point where there is no rebuilding, no reconciliation. He will have succeeded. Uh, they're going to have to let go, let go of the guilt, the pressure, the burdens, drop the burdens, unload the burdens when they feel they need it. They can, they can get help from other people. They can unload some of the burdens on probably people that celebrated him, people that loved him. They can unload some of the burdens on the support that they have within the home because they will have a solid home, a solid foundation, a solid environment with solid finances. He'll, he will have made sure that he had set them up because he was planning on completely taking himself down for with no repair. Uh, you know, making sure that they're not overly burdened, knowing that he can't be there. So there's definitely be people in place to aid them. And then he's going off on his own fool's path. It's a fearless new beginning. It's free will. He will do this out of free will. The fool card is the free will. Also, it's not knowing what to expect on the other side and having faith in the future, having faith, kind of improvising, obviously very inex inexperienced. Uh, the women will be very inex inexperienced. They will be going on their own journey as well as him going on his own journey. But on the other side, uh, he will be going home to the other side. They will be staying home, being comfortable in a stable environment that they're accustomed to. And they will do a celebration of life uh, for the women that loved him, that had his children, because that's what they're, they're on the table here. Uh, we'll try and we'll celebrate and people, his support will try and celebrate him uh, because this is a celebration of life. So, you know, uh, there will be a lot of people will actually feel safe. Once he's gone, they'll feel more safer. There will be celebrations and parties that he's even gone too from people that don't support him. Uh, so there will be celebration. People that loved him and people that hated him is how I feel with that. Uh, let's get to the center of the deck. Center of the deck here I have here. Yeah, it is emotional manipulation with the king of cups in reverse. Uh, basically with the king of cups in reverse is he will be unavailable. He will not be that perfect loving father. He never was. He was always unavailable, insensitive manipulator, uh, who is very turbulent emotionally and lots of outbursts. Uh, there will be no forgiveness for him by many people, uh, no peace, no kindness, no empathy. He did not have empathy. He did not understand the human condition or even his condition. He was never the perfect family man uh, because he would have to be upright. He is in reverse. Uh, he was never generous with his heart. Uh, he never was in charge of his emotions. He would fly off the handle, very hot and cold, very um, probably explosive rage uh, because he could not control his emotions. Uh, he could not love himself or other people. He was not loved by many and he just cannot control his emotional impulses and outbursts. Very turbulent emotional person. So total manipulator. And then we have here, and he will take himself out to rebuild himself back up. So it's a reversal of fortune with the tower. A, ver a change is coming. And uh, he's probably thinking, even if I'm not here, change is coming. And that maybe they can rise up from the ashes. He's going to take himself out because he doesn't even connect to himself. He doesn't understand emotions at all. He doesn't connect with emotions. So taking himself out is just kind of like a shocking event. And it's just clearing the energy. I'll be out of the way. I don't connect anyways. So it's like an earthquake. For him, it's just, just an earthquake. I'll rise up elsewhere when I go on to the other side. Uh, it's a major life lesson and a major reversal of fortune for him. And basically, yeah, he's just going to, he's going to look at it as that's just clearing the energy. I'm going to have a new spark. And I will be able to have balance and opportunities elsewhere on the other side if he has any spiritual beliefs at all. Uh, but it's just a reversal of fortune for him. And um, yeah, people are going to be shocked. It'll be shocked because it'll be suddenly, unexpectedly, uh, when, when because he's going to do it at the last minute. He's going to do it right when everything starts to fall apart. Boom, it's time for me to go. It's time for me to take the risk on free will and create this very sudden sparked energy boom i'm doing it now i feel harmonious to do it now i'm gonna do it now because i am you're not getting me alive you're not taking me uh so this is how i see it he is not going to be allowed to be arrested and tried and questioned 
he's not going to do it. He's definitely going to give up the battle of life. Any struggles, he's just going to scream, uncle, I'm done. I'm done. I'm taking myself out. I'm just going to do it. You know, it's literal. It's a literal ending. I cannot deny any longer. It's the only option left for me to accept. I'm just going to move on now. You know, I'm just not going to, you know, the painful ending is here. The painful ending is here for me to go and leave. This is his way of leaving. I hope you enjoyed this. Till next time, like and subscribe. Bye, you guys.